morning everyone i welcome all of you in today's lesson in today's lesson we learn our comparative and superlative in german language let's see comparative are used to show the difference between two object if there is a difference then we use comparative form like tom is dicker als john tom is dicker als john and if there is no difference then we use if there is no difference so adjective as it is no change plus v tom is so done we peter tom is as thin as peter no change so no change and no change in adjective tom is glies done we peter as adjective as it is glies we if there is a no difference we use so adjective we let's see further if there is a difference between two we add a er with the adjective plus als let's see adjective plus er plus als mit dem zug bist du schneller er als mit dem auto this is a comparative there is three form in comparative like with the adjective regal message mit umlaut or unregal message now we see about regal message regal message which follow the same pattern this is the meaning adjective and the meaning of the adjective comparative form with er and superlative form there is two superlative form that we read further and the difference between them normally we had er billig billiger am billigsten they the das billigste we had am plus sten in superlative and adjective as per the noun and ste same there is no change in that and after that there is one mit umlaut we had umlaut a l t r and s t e n and there is thus s t e and if the umla if the adjective is ending with these we add the and the superlative form is e s t e n if the adjective ends with day t s s sh x set a then we add e s t e n you can hear alt alter am alteration if you see here gross it does not change to e s t e n this is an exceptions that we have ausnahme with gross is the same like t only we add t e n and after that there is a one unregal message form gan lieber am liebsten there is that liebste good better am besten feel mehr am meisten it does not follow any pattern that you need to remember that now we see one example charlie is langer als sonia adjective with er als sonia now is superlative form expressing the highest or a very high degree of quality earlier we were comparing only two now if the highest best among the rest when he has comparison is the highest whenever the adjective does not accompany a noun when it does not accompany a noun or when is company a noun if it does not accompany a noun then we add am um, adjective plus sten like welches auto is tam back billigsten there is no adjective so we add am um, billigsten which car is the cheapest whenever the adjective accompany by a noun when there is a noun after the adjective we do not use am um, we use the article and ste I have the fastest car. Ich habe das schnellste Auto. Article S T E. Now we see some of the example. And where we put als order we, as we know, als when there is a we comparing two things. 
an adjective with er v v is so as it is so uh, no change in adjective v adjective with er als adjective with er als so v er als so v with er als we let's see some more example yarn land dash als to als comparison adjective should be with er this one let's see one more adela is so dash v monica v adjective should be in same form same form this one let's see das kinder zimmer is dash raum noun noun should be with the article their collection their sizzle is als adjective which should be er their soft is so there should be no change in because so we can't let's see one more example see heart adjective see heart noun this noun sorry and noun should be with the article das ist toy rest client ke kauft there is no noun at the end so adjective should be am um, with the am um. am um, sinelestan if you have any doubt any concern you can write your comment below have a nice day thank you very much for watching this video